Ooh, guys, I'm gonna go with this color. Wipe the tip off, thread it up there, and we is in business. We is in business, guys. All right, guys, I'm fishing the shaker head. I will cast it out. Is this one? No. I will cast it out, wait till it hit the bottom, and probably bounce it like three times. One, two, three, and let it drop back down. I think I'm having bites, but they're just so little they can't uh, really like they can't really swallow it. And this pun is super grassy, so I'm trying to ease my ease my way through that grass. Yeah, I did have a bite, guys. I'm trying to ease my way through the grass because it's it is super grassy out here. Really grassy. And these bait the bass is sitting under that grass, so if they see that commotion, all that grass moving, they going to go find it and see what it is. Here one. Oh, he got off. He took my freaking worm. All right, guys. Let me switch it up a little bit. It's not that late to throw a popper, but why not try it? Why not try it? One just hit it on the popper. <laughs> like the popper bigger than him. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't get to blow it, guys, cause I had my camera off. Don't get me hooked, bro. Don't get me hooked. Look at that, guys. Tiny. All the ones we catching out here is super tiny. But I know for sure. It's a couple 10 pounds in here. And a couple seven, six, five. I know for sure. But we just don't have a boat to reach over there to the shade and like the trees and the lay down. We just basically fish in the open water right here. He got it. Uh oh my god. Bro, I didn't even see what he eat when he ate that. What the heck? Bring your mother back. Please. Guys, that bite, I didn't even see when he ate it. <laughs> like he just came up and just put it, pull it down. Like I, I felt him up there. I, it wasn't no blow up or nothing. Walk the popper. Oh shoot. He hit that soon and hit the water. Let's get back out there. He was a little bigger. He was bigger. I seen he came out the water, like literally come out the water. Yeah, they are aggressive in here. Two bags back to back came literally out the water for this popper. All right, guys, I'm about to try something new. It's more like a, I think it's a 10 inch worm with a ribbon, ta ribbon tail at the end. So let's try that baby out. Me and Jordan are gonna move down and we're gonna think about going to another pond, like dealing with PB size, so. We're just gonna see how that goes because we don't have much time right now. Okay, let me put this up. Matter of fact, we can. All right, guys, we made it to another spot at this pond. So hopefully, we can catch something on this side. It get deep right there. You see that dark water? Yeah. Yeah, super deep right there. I just wish I had my boots on. Wow, guys, let's, I just found a pile of bones. What do you think this from? Wow, look at this. Something died right here. And he got eight. All right, guys, we at this second spot right here. Oh, Jordan already hooked up. We got one more spot after this. So, oh, that's not a bad one, bro. He throwing a popper. I'm gonna start off with this jig. I kind of do every time I haven't fished this in a while. I was saying in a, in, in a while, while. So every time I come out here, I will um throw a jig and I and I really do good with a jig. We got one more spot after this for basically to catch our PBs in. So once again, it's hard to fish out there. It's like it's grown up and the fish. 
the fish just take a long time to like bite. You really got to know how to fish, got to have patient. It's just all above out there. But it's some big, big fish in there. Actually, Jordan caught his PB out of there, I think like three, four weeks ago. Caught his PB out of there. So we about to check it out again after this, after this creek right here. Cigar. Let's try this thing right here. A little swim jig. Ease it on. Here go a little one. On the swim jig. Check them out, guys. <laughs> See you later, buddy. All right, guys, me and Jordan, I, me and Jordan just got to the last pond, but look at this. It's super low. They draining it. They irrigating it. So I don't know how this day going to turn out to. Maybe it's a good thing. Maybe it's a bad thing. But, bro, this sucks, man. This sucks. This sucks. They cut the side right here, but they didn't cut. Like, like the bushes right here but it's all good guys hopefully you will catch some out of here this sucks man yeah guys 30 minutes into fishing no bites maybe because they drained the heck out of this pond it's crazy man and it's sad we've been getting plenty in the rain but why would you drain the pond this freaking low this is dangerous hopefully i can get one of them hungry bass to hit this jig. I'm pretty sure they still healthy in here. Yep. Come on over here, buddy. Oh, this is a pale bass. Look how pale he is. Get back out there, guys. Yeah, guys, I got broken off, but um, Jordan said he caught a nice size bluegill, so let's go ahead and check that out. Oh man, it's my PB. dude, he's huge, dude, fucking, he's <laughs> big. I know that. That was a nice bluegill, Jordan. Yeah. Good catch, bro. I'm going to try this um, shake ahead and see how that works. Damn, man. Having a fun day. Yeah, we probably got like 30 minutes of fishing. So that's not that bad before it get dark. All right, guys, this is going to be the end of the video. It's been a long day. I mean, the, the last pun, it just, just broke my heart, man, because I've been fishing this pun for probably about four years. And, like, to see it that low, me and Jordan just, just stopped fishing because we don't want to put a beating on the fish like that because the water is super, super low. And I only caught one. And he caught a nice size bluegill, though. A nice one. Fat, fat. Yeah, real nice. But the first pun, it was a lot of small ones. And it creaked. He caught a nice one and had a huge blow up at the bank. But other than that, it's been been a good day. We caught fish, so that's all that matters. Fun adventure. Yeah, really fun. But guys, um, this will be the end of the video once again, and I'll catch y'all in my next episode. Peace. Got something to say, bro? See you guys. <laughs> all right.